Well, yes, unfortunately, we knew that it was going to come to this movie. We knew this was the worst POV movie. And yeah, okay, this is Derek Yasha. And today on This Movie Sucks is going to be Quarantine. Okay, one of the most shittiest POV movies I've ever seen in my fucking life. Okay, seriously. Like, what the fuck? Mainly, you had the poster spoiling the ending, you know? So, yeah, um, pretty much uh, the movie was already spoiled for you. And not only that, you know, the movie starts off, of course, with this, uh, you know, reporter going to, you know, this firehouse place. And, of course, um, you know, talking with the firemen, this and that. And they go on a little expedition with, with uh, the firemen people. All right, so then uh, we come to this building which, uh, you know, is uh, being probably condemned and all of that. They go in there, of course, you know, there's uh, people that have rabies, and of course that they're zombies, but done in a shitty way, okay? Done in a fucking shitty way. And, you know, the police guy, is his character is done shitty. You know, that guy's character is done shitty, you know, um... I guess everybody's acting sucked, you know. And sort of the zombies did suck in the movie. And I'm not lying. You know, uh, mainly, uh, you know, the guy goes in there and he's uh, he's asking the woman, are you all right? Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. Blah, blah, blah. And then she turns into a fucking zombie or some shit like that. But, you know, mainly for me, this movie is fucking forgettable. You know, um, I erased it out of my memory completely. That's until, you know, I watched a review of Spoonie's uh, review on Quarantine, okay? Uh, sort of, it was not a review, it was a rant, but let me get back to the movie. Well, anyways, you know, the, the, you know, the shitty cameraman, of course, they're being attacked by a zombie. And what the, what the fuck does he do? Uh, he doesn't use the camera how you're supposed to use it if you're going to go against the zombie. Like, back smack it with the side of the camera. No, he uses the front of the camera, you know, like the, the little plastic uh, thing for the lens. Okay, well, he just keeps on going like this to the zombie. And just like, you know, back and forth, hitting it, hitting the camera in, in the, the zombie's head like this. You know, just keeps on hitting it and hitting it and hitting it. So basically, you're just seeing shots like this. You know, the camera just keep on hitting her head, which is kind of fucking stupid. Everybody wasn't scared. Everybody was laughing in the theater. I was even laughing in the theater. Okay, and then, you know, you just have stupid scenes, okay? Little girls, uh, you know, handcuffed to the stairs. Okay, and she's a zombie or some crap like that. See, this movie's fucking forgettable, and, and it's going to make you confused of what you're talking about, okay? But mainly... You know, oh no, let's just, let's not just uh, uh, use a fire axe on her and just kill her. No, let's just leave her there. So then whenever we're trying to run up the stairs, so then she can try to grab one of us and kill us. Okay, really. That does not make no fucking sense. And the characters are just stupid in this movie. They don't have any weapons at all. You know, um, I think I remember the, the police guy dying real shitty. You know, I think I remember, you know, them dying real shitty. Of course, you know, the main character dying real shitty at the last scene. And the last 15 minutes is just her just shrieking like this. <gasps> All right, you go over there. You go over there. <sighs> and, you know, she gets fucking dragged away in the most shittiest manner. And then what happens is the zombie comes up close to the camera and, of course, kills our second main character which is behind the camera, and then the camera shuts off, and there we go, shitty ending. But overall, you know, this movie doesn't deserve your views. Um, if you do have DVDs, uh, break them, burn them, do what you have to do to get rid of them, okay? Because this movie does not need to be on the face of the earth. This is one of the worst zombie POV movies I've ever seen, okay? Uh, mainly Cloverfield has done a lot better, okay? The Blair Witch Project is way done better than this fucking movie. 
you know, uh, mainly any other movie is way done better. Any POV movie that you could think of, okay? But yeah, pretty much, uh, you know, uh, some of it, the cinematography looked like it was straight to on video. And some of it just looked like an actual movie at some parts. But, you know, mainly for me, I did not really give a shit about the movie when, you know, it was over. I was just pretty much clapping when it was over. You know, and saying, yeah, finally, this piece of shit is over. And people agreed with me in the theater. Yeah, man, yeah. And, you know, we threw popcorn at the, the screen, this and that. You know, and pretty much uh, from there on, um, you know, when I got out of the theater, uh, mainly the, the cardboard box poster thing, you know what I wanted to fucking do to it? I wanted to, to beat the shit out of it, but of course that, you know, I would get thrown out, out of the theater and probably in handcuffs for breaking something that, that is not that fucking great in the first place. But yeah, you know, pretty much that's what sums up the movie. You know, that pretty much it's a terrible heap of a dog shit and cat piss and, of course, uh, you know, cow throw-up that the movie is. So, yeah. You know, and I can't believe they made a straight-to-DVD sequel to this, but I won't watch that. I will never watch that. Quarantine 2. Seriously? Are you serious? Uh, mainly what they did was they ripped off snakes on a plane, but except it's zombies on a plane. Well, you know what I have to say to Quarantine 2? Fuck you, too. Because you ain't gonna get my view. Fuck you. You ain't gonna get my view, okay? Because you're pathetic and you're stupid, movie, okay? My God, and... Ugh. You know, you know what they did? You know what they fucking did? They, they were saying, oh, this is gonna be the best zombie POV movie ever made. Well, no, it's a back smack, okay? It's a back smack. For a stupid piece of shit movie like that, seriously, like, thumbs way, 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 way down. Okay, seriously, like, way down, super way down. You know, and this movie was super bad. <laughs> super bad. <laughs> you get the joke because the movie's super bad. <laughs> no, but I'm dead serious. This movie was super lame. You know, just pure up garbage. You know, um, what I would rather do is basically, uh, you know, let somebody uh, basically slit my throat or shoot me in the head than to watch this movie again. You know what? I, you want to know what else I would do than than to rather watch this stupid movie again? Uh, mainly for me, I would rather get. Um, you know, spikes or, you know, needles and put them in my eardrums so I won't have to hear and gouge my eyes out and, of course, uh, you know, mainly rip my nose off so I won't smell this shitty movie and look at the damn... And I want to rip off my fingers so I won't pick up the damn cover. Okay, but uh, other than that, you know, what a piece of dog shit of a zombie movie. Seriously. My God, man. And this had to have been one of the worst movies I ever seen in my life. One of the worst POV movies I ever seen in my life. Okay, that that's saying a lot, you know, for me to want to gouge my eyes out. Basically, uh, for me to pierce my ear so, so I won't have to hear the movie. And to cut my own fingers off to basically not want to pick up the cover and look at the cover. So what, is the, what does that tell you right there? Pretty much this movie is god-awful. It's garbage. Okay, pretty much what I did was blew my nose with the ticket. Pretty much so. You know, I blew my nose with the ticket. And, of course, spit on it, piss on it, and shit on it. That's what, that's what I did with the damn ticket. You know, and mainly for me, it would be a lot better if the movie did not even exist, to be honest with you. So, yeah, okay, pretty much that's it for This Sucks, all right, peace.